a potential sighting of Madalena Kojakari in California has sparked a new uh, round of hope, really, for people who want to see the Cornelius girl found safely, and that's everyone. You may remember Madalena was last seen in public back in November as she was getting off of a school bus. Both her mother and stepfather have been jailed since December after failing to report her disappearance. WCNC Charlotte's Jesse Pierre live in Cornelius now. Jesse, this this tip really brought such a sense of relief in a way and really renewed hope that this little girl will be found. Definitely hope, you know, efforts to find Madalena Kojakari have not stopped. I'm standing outside of the Cornelius Police Department and there are still several missing poster, missing persons posters with her face on it. There are yellow ribbons in support of her and the police department tell me that every tip they receive are looked into. I'm a parent and my daughter went to Madalena's school and my son has played with children in her neighborhood and it was just heartbreaking to see that she's missing. It's been nearly eight months since Madalena Kojakari was last seen in public getting off a school bus back in November. Now a post on the Find Madalena Kojakari Facebook group is getting some attention after a woman shared her belief that she saw the Cornelius girl in California. Everybody's holding out hope that that she can be found. In the post, the woman who did not want to be interviewed shared an encounter with a young girl who appeared to be alone asking for a ride at a gas station in Weaverville in Northern California. Concerned about her personal safety, she did not give her a ride, but did report the sighting to Cornelius police after she stumbled onto Madalena's missing report. Cornelius police say they are aware of the tip and detectives are following up on the information. In the meantime, former FBI agent M. Quinton Williams says the best thing people can do is share Madalena's photo. Now we have social media and everybody is empowered. As long as you're on the platform, you are empowered to get the word out. So at the very least, everybody can blast it on the Internet. He applauds the woman's effort to report the incident because he says all information is important in cases like these. We have about 850,000 law enforcement officers in America, but we have over 330 million people. The way we're going to solve crime is if those 330 million people are involved with the solutions of these cases. The Post has sparked a glimmer of hope for local residents. And it does bring it back up to the surface, which is important because we do, we get busy and we forget and it's you know really important to keep keep her name in the the forefront of our minds now police have not indicated if that was or not madalena or any more details on that tip they do say that they the number of tips they get every day does change but it is important that everyone who can continues to put madalena's photo out there continues to share her story so that she can be one day found and brought home live in cornelius jesse pierre wcmc charlotte yeah we all hope that jesse thanks so much